Warning, this show contains content inappropriate for children and mature adults. So buckle the fuck up. Listeners, get your drinks and movie ready. We will let you know when to push play if you want to watch along, or you can just listen to the events unfold. Now, ladies and gentlemen, the moment you've been waiting for. Here they are, some dudes in a movie. Hello and welcome to Some Dudes in a Movie, where we are making movies better, bringing you a show that is form-fitted and tailored for greatness. My name is Corey. Right. You can shout from the kitchen. We belong. <laughs> My name's Narn. <laughs> Long pause. This is Cristobal. In Spanish and in English, Christopher. All right. Hopefully Chris. the jokes get better from here. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So uh, today. Press we're... one if you want Spanish. <laughs> All right, Chris. Chris. <laughs> okay, we can continue. I think that's. I think Chris is over seventeen right now. Uh, we're yeah, gonna, yeah. We're just gonna start at seventeen, so that yeah. we have something to work for. Yeah, you he's know. he's got a handicap. Yeah, he's got a handicap. <laughs> <laughs> he always gets a handicap. That's not fair. <laughs> hey, you guys, I'm handicap not funny. parking. You can almost, <laughs> dude, you guys, I'm especially not funny today. So could you take it easy on me? No. Um, <laughs> what? All right, so I'm actually revealing the movie in a little bit different way this time around. I'm just going to play it, and then you guys can figure it out as it's going, or until the main title shows. Is it up. Pitch Black right now? Um, right now, yes. I thought we'd start it out with Pitch Black, and then it'll just fade into another movie entirely. Oh, the TV's not on. Okay. Oh, is it happening? That's awesome. It's happening. Okay. All right. Okay, put this thing. How can I put this thing in my ear so that I can hear it? But I, I don't can know. Still how can you, you guys? How, how can you put that thing in your ear? <laughs> I know how I can put I my. I feel thing like in I already ear. know what it is. You do? Yeah, Columbia Pictures only made like two movies. Like that. <laughs> That's true. New York, New Jersey. I'm really glad that the subtitles <laughs> had subtitles for the writing. <laughs> <clears throat> Columbia, Columbia Pictures, Pictures presents. presents. Okay. Let's try to guess what this is. Hey, Just Jerry Wontraub. Come on, you guys are familiar so. with Jerry Wontraub. <laughs> <laughs> a job. Okay, so there's the a bridge. Music. And, okay, so... What's, Where is this? Think Boston? What city, think what city this might be in. Full House. <gasps> Toy tell, Louis. Okay, so it sounds like they're Italian. Yeah, but then there's a Brooklyn. You know, there's also... Nice car. Is John Travolta in this? No. Oh, he should be. This is a national lampoon. You know, all those kids no. are all those kids are chasing that car because like, hey, give me my fucking bike back. <laughs> oh, the crazy! Oh, yeah. oh. <laughs> <laughs> is, is this the one where he dresses up like a shower? A yeah, dude. Machio, Machio, you guys. <laughs> uh, dude, did Mr. Miyagi die recently? He did. He did. Oh, dude. 2005. Oh, Rest recently, recently, as of nine years ago. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's in the 2000s. <laughs> Fuck you guys. It's in the same century. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Who's talking right now? Okay, dude. So, uh, his mom. I need a pen so I don't repeat the same facts. Hmm. I just got a shelf up my ass. This movie is great. Ralph no. Macho, he looks uh, he, look, he was, I last saw him in Entourage, and he looked fucking old. He has the same face. Want to know what's weird? Because he is super old, but not as old as you think. Ralph Macchio is 22 in this movie. Okay. Yeah. No one on the cast believed him. He's, like, he's playing like a teenager, like, in high school. That's pretty normal in Hollywood to have, like, you know, people in their late 20s to be a teenager. I know, but he looked like 22 and fucking, I don't know. <laughs> He looked. That was he good. looks like young as an actor. Thank you. Hey, good job, Ryan. Good input, Chris. How you doing? <laughs> 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 Sorry, I can't fully. So did driving. Here, buddy. So did driving from Brooklyn all the way to California. Yeah, and all they packed. Man. All he, all they packed was one bike. I think that's pretty crazy. You know, oh, they yeah. didn't have very much. <laughs> this looks like Utah Italians or are very Arizona. resourceful with their bikes. <laughs> Ah, Canyon. So, canyon Portal. Ralph Good Macchio recently portal. showed up in How I Met Your Mother because Barney's Bachelor Party. 
Um, he loves the Karate Kid, and he sees it as the story about a young kid who's head of his class, which is Johnny's character, mm-hmm. and then some nobody who's an Italian comes in and defeats his dreams of winning the championship. So he totally sees the movie as a reverse way. So they get Ralph Macchio to come in and be like his best friend and act just like Barney to mess with him. Mm-hmm. It's fucking hilarious. But uh, yeah, Ralph Macchio was also in the movie Hitchcock, um, older film, My Cousin Vinny. He was in The Outsiders, huh. which I totally don't remember him being in The Outsiders. The NWO? He was in the NWO as The Outsiders? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin Nash played him. <laughs> What the fuck? That guy's in everything. Yeah, but no, he did the big boot. He raised both his arms and one of his legs. He did the big boot. What a power bomb. That's crazy. <laughs> that's, that's true. And then that uh, one time when, he, when Ralph Macchio's in this movie, he has Super Shredder. Yeah, that's yeah. crazy. Yeah, he's 22 here. He sounds like a kid, too. I know. God, How old he so- came late for Ralph Macchio. Hey, fuck Ralph Macchio. I just decided. <laughs> Mom, do you remember packing well, my back bike? Back in the 80s, like, don't mess with me. I'm the karate kid. <laughs> <sighs> what? <laughs> <laughs> like, 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 <laughs> yeah, explain it. <laughs> this is my favorite part. <laughs> <laughs> like, that was our action hero back then. Oh, okay. Well, actually, I know something interesting about the karate kid. Um, the karate kid was actually a DC character. A superhero in the Legion of Heroes, like back in the day, and they actually had to contact DC and get permission to use the title for the movie, The Karate Kid, and they let him do it like free of charge. You know, so pretty cool on DC. I, that's cool. I still have to say that The Karate Kid is still better than any Superman movie I've ever seen. If we're talking about DC, whoa, I'm, I'm going there, <laughs> dude. The Karate that. Kid is actually a great movie. This there is we go. Be, look at him. This is going to be interesting because we we are actually watching a legitimately good movie. This time around. Making bacon. Classy. Classy shirt he's got there of two pigs fucking. <laughs> what? <laughs> this guy, look at his shirt. There's two pigs humping each other and it says making bacon. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? Well, this is my day shirt. <laughs> <laughs> dude, there's this one douchebag I saw um, at the mall. He was wearing a shirt. It was like nice riding and it was like... Pussy, the most expensive food I ever ate. <laughs> he's just like walking around, like wearing the shirt. Like, you are the biggest <laughs> douchebag ever. He's like, I think this is my pussy is expensive shirt day. <laughs> he was like, no, he obviously has a job interview somewhere in the mall. <laughs> <laughs> well, Spencer's. Spencer's, yeah. It's like, yeah, we do need, need people here at the children's uh, place, whatever, whatever fucking daycare they have in the mall these days. <laughs> Dude, that's a, that's the mom from uh, ha- uh, Happy Gilmore. That's the grandma from Happy Gilmore. Shit, yeah, it is. Huh? Take that, random facts. I see. Give me. Want to borrow my shirt? <laughs> <laughs> Man, neighbors are so <laughs> nice. Over here. Yeah, I know. love this shit. Why? Uh, why is he helping him? <laughs> Pull his bike up the stairs. Hey, bikes back then weighed close to about 100 to 150 pounds. Depending on the brand, of course. I assume. Dude, shorts, man. Because she was bad shit crazy. Nice pants. Those are dad pants. (laughs) Probably because he's 22 fucking years old. (laughs) <laughs> Sounds like a great fix it guy. You're gonna like wander around. No number to call. Uh, how old is he supposed to be in the movie? Um, I forget. He's in like high school. Mm-hmm. Maybe he got held back a lot of years. See, now that I know he's 22 and not like, I pictured him like, what, 14, 16, it's not as creepy that I'd go over to Mr. Miyagi's house to take off his shirt and just like watch the cars all day. <laughs> so, that's how he learned how to fight. He's like, hey, I know you get bullied around, but come over to my house. And just take off your shirt and watch the car. <laughs> We're going to teach you self-defense. <laughs> Why do I got to watch the car? Uh, no reason. He's just sitting in the back like rubbing his stomach. <laughs> mm, Daniel son. <laughs> Daniel son. Muy bueno. Now that's a different language, machio. Speaking of Daniel son. Should we do 
a name drinking game. We need a karate kit. You I, fuck I up for this every time, and we you <laughs> have to drink this time. Okay, Some I stuff. think I think we should just keep it simple. We use everyone's names, but we have to put son on the back of it. So Naren son, oh. Ryan son, Chris son, Corey son. I really wanted to be something like. I wanted. I had something else in mind. What What did you have in mind? You guys have to go first. We gotta go in order. Well, we gotta know what we're doing. <laughs> I wanna be. I wanna be the ultimate Cambodian. Oh, are you coming up with fighting name? names? This, yeah. this would be good for, like, a wrestling movie. Uh, is there a movie with the ultimate warrior? Can we watch that next? <laughs> <laughs> okay. I, I want to say what I would be. What? I would be Little oh. Grasshopper. Nice. That's cute. Oh. I forgot he was uh, the fix-it guy. I, there's so many things I don't remember about this movie. All I remember is that he, did, he wanted to impress a girl at a <laughs> Halloween party, so he dressed up as a fucking bathtub. Which is, uh, oh, cool check out his cutoffs, dude! Guys. His shorts are amazing. Yeah, who who wears clothes that mm. cut off part of the way and doesn't fit his body? You know, uh, Chris, Pat Morita, <laughs> um, he almost didn't get the part because they didn't want like a comedian, which I didn't know he was a comedian. Wait, Mr. Miyagi was a comedian? Yeah, but they he almost didn't get the part. But after he read, they liked him a lot more than everybody else, so he got the part. And do you know who almost got the part of Daniel, who they tried to cast? Who? Charlie Sheen. Char- that would have been interesting. Charlie Sheen is a karate kid. And he would have been in uh, Hot Shots or something. Or uh, whatever fucking movie. Yeah, they're like, do the truth missile. <laughs> He's like, okay. <laughs> oh, he's showing off for her. He's like, watch how good I am. So oh, you like oh, this. He stole it from him. Wait till you see my bathtub costume, bitch. You're going to get so wet. <laughs> <laughs> because I'm a bathtub. And I, that's, you get wet inside of a bathtub. Get it? All right, nobody. Ah, I stopped listening. <laughs> <laughs> what other movies? Are Why is that in slow motion? <laughs> uh, Elizabeth Shue. Oh. You know what? I wrote her down to write down movies, but it was like super fucking boring. So I didn't. Mm-hmm. Take By the way, any of her stuff. If anyone's paying attention, like he really hasn't said anything to her. Dude, I really like this song playing right now. Hey, so, well, listen. He's got really good nonverbal communication. Hey, you know what's gonna happen here? Like, he's gonna he's gonna grill this hot dog and he's gonna deep throw it in front. But of her. I mean, <laughs> she's it gonna is kind of creepy that she's gonna girls, love this. But those girls are trying to hang out with each other, and then all of a sudden these dudes are not really talking to them, but always where they're at. Hmm? I stopped listening, dude. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> what's going on? <laughs> Maybe they're at their prospective like summer camps, you know, for kids. <clears throat> No, there's not. There's no time they went to a summer camp. This fucking alley, Chris. <laughs> this is the you first time that they've, that they've started talking. So hey, uh, my name's Daniel. I've been hanging out next to you for the past ten hours. Okay, today. this is a really dumb like girl coming over to hit on a guy. Like, oh, how'd you do that knee thing? Teach me a sport. Like when I first met my <laughs> wife, she was like, so how'd you do that? Like, put a cannoli in between your legs and squeeze out all the juices. <laughs> trick. And I was like, well, it's pretty simple. I'll show you. <laughs> Because <laughs> I know you, you want to have that skill so bad. Yeah, I thought it, I thought it was kind of weird. <laughs> Man, you know you know what I miss about the '80s movies? The '80s Head bad bands? guy. The oh. '80s bad guy. Whoa, well, check movie. it out! This, this gang has matching jackets. This is a dude. William Zabka, who plays Johnny, still has the red jacket. No, he's, is he still? He, was he on Tosh Point now? Um, yes, he was. He Along with. The bad guy sensei. Martin Cove, who yeah. plays the bad guy uh, sensei. Keith, yeah. What who it? is my third favorite bad guy of all time in movies? Is the dojo guy. Um, that my one. my number one is probably the bad Nazi dude from uh, Inglorious Bastards. Oh yeah. Because that guy is just terrifying. Who? And extremely smart. The uh, Christoph. Christoph Waltz. Yeah. That dude, I love him in that movie. My second is probably Heath Ledger as Joker, and then my third is <laughs> the evil sensei in The Karate Kid. Oh, oh snap. We haven't met him yet, have oh, we? Oh, no, dude. He is the fucking best. Hairdo alone, like, moves him up the chart. He's been so much better than 10 feet of Sam. Cut it. Don't, don't touch it, Why punk. Why you cutting things? One job, right? Hey! 
He just shoved the boombox speakers whoa. first into his whoa. chest, and when he fell, the speakers were the other way whoa, around. Whoa, whoa, them those is fighting words. Whoa, he just tripped him into the sand. You know, I'm the karate guy around oh, here. Oh, he tripped him again in a cool way. Dude, his so shiny like, pants and leather jacket. So Johnny likes that girl too, huh? Oh, yeah, dude. that's yes. Johnny's girl. That's dude. why he wears that headband. Oh, even a headband. Dude, what's with all these other people? Like, hey, how about we just stand here and watch him fight and beat him up? Like, Because he's a ninja. Oh, a sucker punch. What's that? It looks like he's about to call a timeout. <laughs> like, that's a weird post. Yeah. No Did mercy, it? man. I love 80s bad guys. They were the best. Dude, hands down, yeah. Easy. The best, like... Oh. And you know what's also good? Bad guys in their 80s. <laughs> you want to laugh, man. For real, man. Go for it. Just no, it's right. It. No, it's okay. Feel I'll, it coming I'll out from right. inside. I'll be all right. I think I'll be okay. He got his ass kicked by a guy who's trained to fight. <laughs> <laughs> you have dumb friends. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Seriously. Hey, are you okay? Because if it was me fighting that guy, I totally would have kicked his ass. So, let's talk about the elephant in the room. The song <laughs> at the end of the movie, You're the Best Around. Oh, yeah. Hands down. By the way, you cut the, uh, you the, cut the thing best weird, song <laughs> made for a movie <laughs> on the weird. planet. The best around? You're the best around. Not the better ever get you down. Yeah, the best. I didn't mean. Yeah, like the greatest song made be for a movie you on the one planet. Shot. <laughs> and I'm about to blow your guys' mind with a fact about the song You're the Best Around. Mm -hmm. Ready? That song was originally up for another movie. What movie? Rocky Three. Uh, yeah, it sounds like it'd be a Rocky movie. I was gonna yeah. because there's a there's a part in the song that says history repeats itself. Just try and you'll succeed. It's because it's referencing the old Rocky movies, but that song got beat out and chosen uh, and was beat out by Eye of the Tiger. Yeah, Eye of the Tiger oh, was chosen wow. over it. And then this song, this movie got that song. They didn't change the lyric about history repeats itself, mm -hmm. but. Um, Survivor, who does Eye of the Tiger, also does a song in this movie as well. Like, instead of A History Survivor? Repeats Itself. Yep. That's the name of the band? Yep. It's like, instead of huh. History Repeats Itself, what would you do? What would you make the, uh, what would you change the lyric to? I'd be like, this fucking car won't clean itself. Because <laughs> he has to clean the car. I'd be like, like history will teach you stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Try and use it. See, just a little word switch. <laughs> this is a totally different song. <laughs> you know, hold on. There's like a guy who's training, listening to lyrics, like, you know what? I am going to take a history class. <laughs> <laughs> you okay? No. Nope. Uh, All right. If you hear quiet chewing and giggling, that's Ryan the entire time. Uh, Ryan. Ryan's, Ryan. Hey, Ryan. High five, bro. Hey, Ryan. Welcome to the party. Just eat, their, just, just eat food, man. That's what you're here for. You're just here to eat and drink and listen. Yeah. You need to say something sometime, though, so we can not laugh at it for a period of time and then laugh oh, at it. Oh, hey, we're all going to be working on our bikes in our polos. Look at those tiny headphones. I remember those with, like, the weird yeah, the wire stuff ones? that, like, ripped open. Like, that weird mesh. Yeah, remember, uh, now now headphones are, like, a lot bigger now. Like, with your own... Like Drake. Says the dude with yeah, the over-the-ear ones. Yeah, dude, put a fucking <laughs> antenna on them, and it's like the old school. Like, it's like we went super small back to like overly huge. Mm -hmm. Let's make fun of him for getting beat up brutally at the beach. Hey, I mean, you play soccer. Yeah, she didn't know to hit a ball on her knee, and she plays fucking soccer. Oh, no, is she a cheerleader? Oh. Do you guys like this would ever happen? That's like true. she's thinking in her mind in high school that oh this guy just got beat up by another man. I bet he can take care of me. <laughs> <laughs> Female bet, logic. Hashtag. Bitches. I bet he's just a great provider. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. So um, William Zabka was in Hot Tub Time Machine. The guy who plays Johnny. I do not remember him in that movie. I think he was the. Bad guy? Probably. 
He makes a good one. And he was also in the How I Met Your Mother episode with Barney's uh, bachelor party. Definitely. He's, he's really happy right now that you didn't hear how he said that. Definitely. Shorts, man. Oh, they're playing something big. Dude, he's Italian. You should want him on your soccer team. Yeah, seriously. It's all they fucking do is that and make pizzas. Holy cow. <laughs> so what are you doing after practice? Making pizzas. <laughs> <laughs> Anything besides that? Sweating. <laughs> hey, we're done with all these pizzas. You want to go play some soccer? <laughs> <laughs> hey, if you, guys, you know, guys, knock it off. I'm multitasking. What are you hey, doing? Make just so you know. Wait, 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 wait. Is it pizza just so you know. everybody in soccer? If you guys get out some breadsticks, Ryan cut it the opposite way. <laughs> Like, they're, uh, they're clearly this way. <laughs> oh, this way. he got a good one in. Hey, nobody hits me. Nobody hits me again. Everyone in the state hates me. God, look at, the, look at those sweatpants, man. Or the torn off sweatshirt. I'm going to go play for the rival team. Uh, yeah, that'd be a great B story. He's like, you know what? I can buy a car. <laughs> Suck all that, rest of you guys. Anybody need alcohol? I can buy that shit too. Because <laughs> I, I am 22 years old. I have infiltrated the school. <laughs> Look at you kicked out of your group of friends. Fuck you guys. If you need me, I'm leaving the school going to a titty bar. Booyah. I'm gonna go gamble in Las Vegas, bitches. <laughs> Karate. <coughs> it's like, really, it's just kicking. That's all you're doing. And we all kicked each other. <laughs> like, seriously, his. Like, seriously, the left side of his body was so sore. He's on, on 13. <laughs> time. He's on 13. <laughs> <laughs> and he's on 13 kicks. And he's hey, he's probably, sweat. Hey, he's probably doing like other th stuff with the other leg, you know, like making pizzas, practicing karate. <laughs> like right now, it looks like he's fixing something, but really he's making noodles. <laughs> <laughs> How are you gonna fix my faucet with chopsticks? <laughs> he's like, I will admit it. The whole time he's fixing his faucet, you know, this kid will look really good cleaning my car. Yeah, look, <laughs> I'm gonna support my training like, and, hey. and a rigid exercise regimen. With this sauerkraut oh. and a small bun. That's what hey, she's pretty cute this movie. <laughs> Dude, in your head, you really thought that sauerkraut joke was just gonna <laughs> blow up, didn't you? <laughs> Did you say something? I was totally entranced on the movie. Ryan's, Ryan doesn't like to talk to anybody or listen. All right, He just likes to eat pizza and snicker every now and then. And when I'm done, I'm like... All right, cool. See ya. <laughs> Bye, guys. <laughs> Thanks for lunch. <laughs> Kick right. Oh, ex-boyfriend. But anyway, Chris, what's been going on? Oh, I was just thinking about how maybe this movie is like a metaphor for this little kid who like gets cancer in high school. Do we have Tim? Everyone Tim? thinks that they're like, ha ha. Do we have Tim too here. You have cancer. But then he trains real hard and beats the shit out of his cancer, and everyone's like, Whoa, you're cooler than ever. What? Yeah, dude, 10 bucks says your cancer had a headband. <laughs> <laughs> but I beat it. <laughs> the doctors are like, We removed the cancer, here's the tumor. And here's the actually, no, Chris actually, did play, Chris actually did play soccer. No, he did play soccer back then. That's true. And he did get his ass kicked by a cancer and a headband. A few times, too. <laughs> oh, dude. He just hit him dude, repeatedly, all one, the side. Time. Hit him repeatedly guys, one side in his face. The you guys time. didn't even notice? I wasn't even there for a whole year because he was beating the shit out of me the whole time. Yeah, and oh. you... Oh, oh this, is, this is a good moment here. No, sensei. Fear does not exist in this dojo, does it? No, sensei. He's got a cardboard cut out of himself. It's amazing. Dude, I totally have a cardboard cut of myself. He kind of looks like Val Kilmer. I was just going to say that. Is oh he played God. by Val Kilmer? No. No. <laughs> Martin Cove. 
<laughs> Close. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, for the last 30 years, I've been telling everyone Val Kilmer's been banging his face. <laughs> so, oh, shit. real quick. Hey! Nice. Why are there fucking you know subtitles for the words? <laughs> Stop sign. <laughs> <laughs> Men's restroom. So, Martin Coe, <laughs> I, I got some good movies that he was in. Crocodile 2, okay. Death Swamp. <laughs> uh, it's better. It's better. The, the Thief and the Stripper. Huh. Sounds like a good one. Yeah. Was she robbed of her clothes? Probably. <laughs> she wasn't supposed tips. to be a stripper. She was just a waitress. <laughs> <laughs> uh, ma'am, those are nice titties, but we're at Denny's. I'm with my family. <laughs> Hercules. <laughs> With Kevin Sorbo. Of course. He played a part in there. Nice. He also played a part in Walker, Texas Ranger. Of course, he knows karate is a bad guy, right? Probably. Um, mm-hmm. And Death Race 2000. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Sylvester Stallone. Shit's just about to go down. Because your mother's broken needs to turn more tricks. What does she do for a living? She moved all the way from one side of the country to this. Turn tricks, I just told you. She turns tricks? No, I don't know. I don't know what she does. I don't know, I don't know what that means. Of course you're trying. <laughs> she does tricks. <laughs> she turns, she's, she's at a grocery hey. store. She's at the grocery store, she sees a box of kit tricks, and she just turns it around. <laughs> <laughs> well, like, that's my day. I thought these looked weird backwards. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's my day. Time to go make pizza. <laughs> Between playing soccer, cooking pizza, and turning tricks, I don't know. Are you guys still you talking about that good mother? thief and a stripper? No. <laughs> Corey, what, how are you reading only coherent ones right now? <laughs> I, I, don't, I don't know. Dun, what did dun, you dun, do dun, to the <laughs> Heroin. <laughs> What's going on? <clears throat> so, oh, this is, this, is a, this is a good scene right here. So here's a story about Pat Morita. He was in... Um, a lot of the Kingdom Hearts games. He was also did a voice in SpongeBob. He was in Karate Dog. Oh, dude, the music picked up. Hell yeah. Things oh, are about to go down. It's a bikey gang. Ryan, is this your crew? <laughs> <laughs> you should wear a headband. On dirt bikes. Oh, dude, that's messed up. Hey, I'm slowly rolling down this hill. You did Whoa. that on purpose. Whoa! He's still and it's someone different. Want to know what's crazy? They got a 13-year-old stuntman. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, we need someone who looks your age. Um, <laughs> oh, dude, just think of how awkward that was when like they introduced him for the first time. Like, and here's your stunt double. <laughs> he's 13, but he's their size and looks like you. Yeah. Um, but Pat Morita was also in Karate Dog, in Baywatch. He was in the Hughleys. He was in Mulan. He was the emperor in that. He was in Bloodsport 3, Spy Hard. He did a couple roles in Boy Meets World. And in Lamb Chop Special Hanukkah. Hmm. He's in a Hanukkah show. Seems Jewish. Yeah. But I was thinking about the Karate Kid superhero. I wonder if he ever went to, like, a planet or something like that where there was all, like, aliens made of wood. (laughs) He's like... Yeah. (laughs) Hold up. <laughs> like yeah. breaking him? Or like cement blocks and they're like, quick, stacking attack formation. He got up and he got up on a ladder and he's like, ka And breaks all down the center. Yo, you guys watch the new Karate Kid with Jaden Smith? Oh, fucking, let's not even talk about it. First of all, it's the exact same story. You move to somewhere else, I hate it, and gets in a fight like one girl is dating someone. It's the exact same storyline, but different country. Hold on. And he learns Kung Fu. Why the fuck are you in a Karate Kid movie and you learn Kung Fu? That makes absolutely no sense. And in this one, it has him, like, secretly learning stuff through different chores. And in that one, he's like, take off your jacket. Put it on the ground. Now hang it up. Now put it back on. Now take off your jacket. Put it on the ground. Oh, I didn't, I didn't it watch it that far. Put either. it on the ground. I watched the whole thing, and oh, I was I like, I want to murder someone. And the children are, like, fucking superheroes. Hmm? Like, they're, like, climbing up rooftops and flipping over fences. And I'm like, 
What is happening? Like, Bro, they, are, for the they, army. Are, they are legitimate Asians, so, you know, they could do all that shit. That's I haven't true, done that They're like, purebred Asians. I haven't done that stuff since, like, yesterday. But it's you know? not all about that, though. This movie is about, like, learning that there's more than fighting, bettering yourself, and that there's more to karate than just punching people in the face. It's also about standing up against people, and, you know, it's so much more than just but here's, Will Smith's son. Here's what I like about clips. Here's what I like about Jaden Smith, though. I mean, like, his dad... He was a pussy from he got in a fight one fight in West Philadelphia and moved all the way to Bel Air. But <laughs> Jaden, he stood up for himself. Right. He did. And I remember his parents were super upset at him for uh, standing up for himself. And I love that part where Jackie Chan looks at him and goes, Look, parents just don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> it's a Will Smith song, Chris. Uh, yeah. I feel bad doing what I did to them early. <laughs> because look at him, he's, he's just like, veggie out. He's like not making sense. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm trying to hear the, uh, I'm trying to hear this. That's why we're reading it, bro. That's why I have one in. I only have one in. Well, then what's your excuse? Because it, it falls out of my ear. <laughs> okay, but you had your hat on before. You <laughs> put, your head, put, your yeah. put your head over it. Probably I something. did, but then it like it still it kind of like shifts in my ear. It's shit in your ear. I hate that. Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh, the bike fairy came back. He goes back and he's like, "Hey, uh, I don't have any yen to pay you." It's like, uh, he, money. he kicks the shit out of like, I threw the bike away on purpose. <laughs> 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 Fuck you and your Chia pets. <laughs> hey. Hey. No, they're plastic. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to piss off whoever has these. <laughs> <laughs> I stole these from the garbage truck. <laughs> 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 so, why is that dead prostitute in the corner? Uh, I. I. You, like <laughs> you like? Come see. <laughs> He's like, I need more flies to catch in my chopsticks. <laughs> <laughs> Come inside. Come inside. So he's a comedian. Has he done any comedy movies? Um, Dude, where's my car? I'm that's not, kidding. That's I not really a comedy. I'm kidding. I don't know. Um, he did voices in like. Did you not hear the list of stuff? Yeah, yeah, he did. Okay, because there's comedies he, in there. Spy Hard. Was he? Oh, that's pretty dope. Yeah. But I see him as this. I know. Me too. He's so, typecasted. You know? He's probably that character in every movie. He has to be that character in the movie. Who is on but Spy I see him, Hard? But I see him as a black guy. I see him as a white in guy. In Spy Hard, um, Leslie Nielsen gets hurt, and then he like goes over to him and he's like... Okay, Corey's <laughs> rubbing his hands after he left. No one can because see Because of this. in this. <laughs> Anybody? Come on! I, I, I got it. Scene. Thank you, Ryan. You two can leave. <laughs> no, I get it. I'll just explain to our millions of viewers what's going on. And then they, they've also done it in a different movie, uh, not with that character, though. Or not with that actor. Hey, his black guy went away really fast, now he got a bruise on his head. Yeah, it's, like, it's moving to his brain. <laughs> it's, moving, it's one of his moving bruises? <laughs> <Yeah>. Shit! <laughs> no, that's from his... <laughs> this is the hey. worst diagnosis ever! <laughs> Who gave a black guy? Actually, I got kicked in the nuts and it just kind of moved up here. <laughs> it, 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 dis it dissipates after a while. Uh, hey, why is your nose bleeding? Uh, I stubbed my toe like three days ago. <laughs> it's one of those he's, he's like laying in bed with someone, his wife wakes up and she's like, ah, ah, she's like, I caught it! <laughs> it's one of those touch uh. things. Seriously, but sex back today was been really dangerous. Ah, oh, my nose! <laughs> uh, uh, hey Dude, Daniel, did he um, give him a tree to trim? Hey Daniel, I, I made pizza for dinner. He's like, here, trim my bush. And he's like, okay, and he went out and bought a tree. And he's like, oh. <laughs> He 
you know, for how thick his accent is, he's really clear. You know how you talk to someone and it's just, it's so hard to hear, understand what they're saying. Yeah. They're just like, oh yeah, I'm dying, And they're like, $10. I don't know. Hey guys, I'm in a room still. <laughs> yeah, but you can't understand this. So. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Wrong dialect. <laughs> I think you understand what he's saying because the fucking captions are on rhyme. So I think, you know, you're giving yourself too much He's credit. like, you know, his writing is really clear. <laughs> <laughs> really have really you noticed? Saying. You know, have he's you... a yellow person. The text has to be yellow. <laughs> you know, have you noticed he has no accent in his text? <laughs> that was the light. Hey, hey, Ryan, color, Ryan, color Ryan color I will coordinate. say this. I will say this in the defense of Ryan's joke. That was a delightful way, you know, to think about your Asian friend. <laughs> your Asian friend? Yeah. yeah, I was only one, so yeah. He, Chris Delightful. Is, Chris is, Dude, I he's have. Like, he's nice and yellow. A couple. It's okay, two friends. <laughs> yeah, yeah, when Ryan stands in front of a mirror. <laughs> <laughs> hey, nerd. Hey, Robert. Who's, who's Robert? <laughs> oh, you know, he's a guy with a Seahawks hoodie right now in the glasses. <laughs> I don't know, I never met this guy. No, 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 like one of those medicine guys. We all know him. He's an MTC a bunch. He's like, hey, Ming Chen, you're here too. Oh my god, there's a fleet of them. I haven't met your cousins. Hey, right, let's go to fun house. Hey, the whole clan is here. <laughs> hey, you surprised me with one of your family reunions. <laughs> this one's really big. Yeah. This one's Tell racist. me about your friend with the gigantism in his head. <laughs> Chris, are you lost? Chris does. <laughs> <that. laughs> uh, Chris is going to show up after the first part of the movie. Yeah, Chris, Chris is just happy to be here, guys. <laughs> <laughs> you guys. You guys, don't even worry about it. I can't hear anything, but I understand everything. <laughs> <laughs> Do not worry, little grasshopper. Wax on, wax off. Hey, we didn't do names. Hey, this is a he, this is a total ad placement for Sprite. Hey, hey, I'm little grasshopper. The little okay. grasshopper. Narn was what? Ultimate warrior. Uh, was uh, that it? Can I be the ultimate warrior? I'd love to be the ultimate. <laughs> no, yeah, I think you, you said you were ultimate, ultimate Cambodian. I want to be the ultimate warrior. I changed my mind. Okay. All right, ultimate warrior. All right, this is gonna get her wet. I'm a, that, I'm a, oh, okay. That is a pretty fucking awesome Halloween costume. Not very practical. <laughs> <laughs> and really, how are you dancing with anybody? That is, dude, you bring them in the tub with you. Ha! <laughs> Snap! Witty. Who is that guy that walked by in like the glasses? I, I didn't even see him. Uh, in the shower, you dumb bitch. You can't hide in that thing. <laughs> He's like, oh, oh, God, I wonder if Daniel showed up. Well, I don't see him in any other regular costumes, and then there's just that weird shower. <laughs> 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 Let's keep looking. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but also, no one would really, everyone would be bumping into you. Yeah. <laughs> yep. That's a good, that is a good point, right? Yes. Saying, yeah. So, I mean, like, they wouldn't have that much privacy. People would just be bumping into him the entire time. I just kidnap people, like open my shower curtain real quick and just grab some, <laughs> and then just like slowly move them out of the dance. <laughs> you will be. Aww, and thank you. He whispers in the ear, he's like, "I'm actually 22." <laughs> <laughs> he's like, "How old are you?" And she's like, "12." He's like, "Okay." How old are you? Twelve. <laughs> <laughs> Let's say it both at the same time. Tw tw <laughs> he's like, he's like twenty. Twelve. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a good thing he's in a shower. I know. Why is he going to the bathroom? Oh, sh worst costume ever. Skeletor. Ha, ha, ha.
<laughs> That's weird. There's a shower in the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> That one makes sense. He's just begging to get his ass kicked. <laughs> hey, so Johnny's sitting there rolling joints and a shower's walking up. <laughs> <laughs> Like, oh my god, someone's singing up. I'm, oh, it's a shower. <laughs> I was worried that I was in the shower. About, but they're in the shower. That's embarrassing for them. Clearly above his head. Well, he's on. Well, he's. You know, he's listening to his headphones right now. So. Dude, what temperature is this water? Is this like really cold or really hot? I don't know. Shut up, Spider Man! <laughs> Dude, take off the giant shower curtain. Oh, who tripped him? Uh, the girl. Oh, dang. And then everybody tripped over him? Dude, she needed to wear a bra with that outfit. Whoa. <laughs> 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 oh, my gosh. The police show up. What happened? Well, the hey, fucking shower hey, ran into the street. <laughs> Were you there last night when a shower caused a... Cause like a You've been drinking. Pile no, I haven't, downtown. I swear. <laughs> no, I swear. Yeah, by the way, <laughs> he doesn't even know the terrain, so him running away from... <laughs> <laughs> look, hey, look. But like, he doesn't, He they just barely moved here. Dude. He doesn't even know the terrain. A true <laughs> green beret. No, 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 no. <laughs> No, he knows where he's going. He fell down his hill a couple days ago, remember? <laughs> <laughs> oh, good. Valid point. This is a good spot. Parkour! <laughs> Parkour! Russian <laughs> climbing! Parkour! Oh, no! Oh, my goodness. You got me wet. His hair looks pretty dry. Because they had been running. Oh, my goodness. You should have been sweating from running, right? Huh? You should have been sweating from running, so. So there you go. <laughs> like a fucking ninja. Ah! Quick, beat up the old man! <laughs> oh, I hate when I have to go beat little children up and kick them in the nuts. Feel like I'm doing this every night. Oh, I thought he does the stupid, like, to Johnny. Like, hold what on, if he's like, oh, like, karate chop people, and Johnny comes over and he's like, pa! <laughs> like, punches through his chest. <laughs> <laughs> It's like, oh shit, I just murdered a child. <laughs> <laughs> Daniel wakes up at his like fix-it shop and he's like, oh, hey, what Wait. happened? He's like, see this heart? Hey. I took care of your bowling problem for you. <laughs> <laughs> no. Wait, hold on, hold on. What was your guys', what was your guys uh, what, uh, names again? I didn't make one. I didn't come up with one yet. Ultimate uh, Warrior. Little Grasshopper. Uh, yeah. Hmm. I don't think we'll be able to repeat that. <laughs> I was like, hey, uh. <laughs> you didn't get the tone right. Like, Dream. <laughs> <laughs> um, little Grasshopper, Ultimate Warrior. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's, it's Johnny's heart. Um, I'm going to go with an old fashioned cartoon here. And go with Hong Kong Fooey. Number one super guy. Hong Kong Fooey? Hmm. Or Hong Kong Fooey number one super guy? Hong Kong <laughs> <laughs> You know what? Hong Kong Fooey number one super no, guy. No, Thanks, no, Chris. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's too long. It's too long. You can call me Hong Kong Fooey for sure. 
<laughs> oh, you're so merciful. You're so merciful to little grasshopper. Mm-hmm. That's dope. I can't think of anything. Well, come up with something. Chop suey. <laughs> <laughs> Um, you've been eating for like 45 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it really said it works. Speaking of uh, 45 minutes, I think we're going to stop and have an intermission. So oh, I don't stop want it. the movie to stop. And one, two, three. All right. And uh, we'll be I back. just because I had, uh, I, I just got stuck watching the movie. Uh, hey, what, what's the time on the movie right now? That's helpful for for the listeners. Forty three nineteen. It's what? I'm getting forty three nineteen. I'm getting there. Forty three nineteen. Telling you. Well, I don't know. Well, it so says on it's the. It's at the part where it says on the DVD player. Miyagi's. Oh. Oh, sweet, nice eyes. Forty three nineteen. Nice. Forty three nineteen. We're just like shut up, Ryan. <laughs> All right, so we'll be back in a minute.